how to knit the little bird stitch, English style. For this tutorial, you will need a pair of knitting needles. Special thanks to our sponsor, Skissel, for providing today's needles. Today, we are using their Addy Lace Interchangeable Clicks in the size 8. And a ball of yarn. Special thanks to our sponsor, Lion Brand, for providing today's yarn. Today, we are using their Vanish Choice Baby Line in the color Bluebell. For this stitch, you'll need to know the following techniques. Knit, purl, slip stitch, cable 3 right, cable 3 left. To begin this stitch, you must cast on in multiples of 14 plus 8. Row 1. Beginning on the right side of our work, we're going to knit all stitches. Row 2. We're going to purl all stitches. Row 3, we're going to begin by knitting 10. So we've got 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Okay, then we're going to start our repeat by slipping the next two stitches purlwise onto our working needle. Then we're going to knit 12. Okay, and then when we come to the last 12 stitches in our row, so we're going to repeat the slip 2 and knit 12 until the last 12 stitches in our row. So when we come to the last 12 stitches in our row, we're going to slip the next two purlwise and then knit 10. Row 4. We're going to begin by purling 10. Okay, then we're going to start our repeat by slipping the next two stitches purlwise to our working needle. Then we're going to end our repeat by purling 12. Okay, so we're going to continue slipping 2 and purling 12 until we reach the last 12 stitches in our row. Now when we reach the last 12 stitches in our row, we're going to slip the next 2 stitches purlwise. Then we're going to finish by purling 10. Row 5. We're going to begin by knitting 8. Okay, then we're going to start our repeat by cabling three right. So we're going to take a cable needle or double pointed needle. We're going to slip the next two stitches off of our main needle and we're going to hold those behind our work. 
Then we're going to knit the next stitch off of our main needle, and this should be that slip stitch from the row before. And then we'll knit the next two stitches off of our cable needle. Okay, now we're going to do a cable three left. So we're going to slip the next stitch off of our cable needle. We're going to hold it in front. Then we're going to knit the next two stitches off of our main needle. And then we'll knit the stitch off of our cable needle. Okay, then we're going to finish our repeat by knitting eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, so we're going to repeat the cable three right and cable three left, then knit eight until the end of the row. Row six. We're going to purl all stitches. Row seven. We're going to knit all stitches. Row eight. We're going to purl all stitches. Row 9, we're going to begin by knitting 3. Then we're going to start our repeat by slipping the next two stitches purlwise. Then we're going to knit 12. So we're going to repeat the slip 2 and knit 12 until the last 5 stitches in the row. Okay, when we get to the last 5 stitches in the row, we're going to slip the next 2 stitches purlwise and then we'll knit 3. Row 10, we're going to begin by purling 3. Then we're going to start our repeat by slipping the next two stitches purlwise. And then we will finish our repeat by knit purling 12. Okay, so we're going to repeat the slip 2 and purl 12 until the last 5 stitches in the row. And when we reach the last 5 stitches in the row, we're going to slip the next 2 stitches purlwise and then purl 3. Row 11. We're going to begin by knitting 1. Then we're going to start our repeat by cabling three right. So we're going to take our cable needle and we're going to slip the next two stitches off of our main needle and hold behind. Okay, then we're going to knit the next stitch off of our main needle and then we'll knit the two stitches off of our cable needle. Okay, then we'll do a cable three left. So we'll take our cable needle and slip the next stitch off of our main needle. Hold that in front. Then we're going to knit the next two stitches off of our main needle. And then knit the stitch off of our cable needle. Okay, then we're going to knit eight to finish our repeat.
Okay, so we're going to continue repeating that sequence until the last seven stitches in our row. Okay, when we get to the last seven stitches of our row, we're going to do a cable three right. So we'll slip the next two stitches onto our cable needle and hold in back. Then we're going to knit the next stitch off of our main needle and then the two stitches off of our cable needle. Okay, then we'll do a cable three left. So we're gonna slip the next stitch and hold it in front, then knit two off of our main needle, and then knit the stitch off of our cable needle. Okay, and we'll, then we'll finish by knitting one. Row 12, we're going to purl all stitches. Repeat rows 1 through 12 until you have reached your desired length. And that's how you knit the little bird stitch. After a few repeats, your pattern should look like this. Want more New Stitch Day? Check out our website at newstitchaday.com.